Merhaba. As I prepared to depart Turkey after nearly three incredible years serving as U.S. Ambassador, I wanted to share my reflections on what we've accomplished together and some of my most memorable experiences. And believe me, there are many. From educational partnerships to cultural exchanges, we fostered deeper understanding and cooperation between the Turkish and American people. Together with the Turkish Ministry of Culture and Tourism, we excavated Gordian, we restored the Roman theater in Ankara, and we protected many other significant heritage sites. I've been thrilled to see the number of student exchanges continue to grow. We have more than 700 Turkish alumni of the Youth Exchange and Study Program, which has been going on for more than 20 years now. And this year, 55 Turkish high school students will study in the United States on full scholarships. We've also celebrated 75 years of the U.S. Turkey Fulbright program, promoting opportunities for talented young people to form lifelong friendships and professional ties between the United States and Turkey. Our efforts to deepen private sector relationships with major initiatives like Trade Wins and the Digital Dialogue have grown our economies and have created opportunities and jobs for businesses and workers in both countries. Turkey is a great country for sports fans. I don't think I've ever watched so much soccer and volleyball and basketball. I've met amazing athletes who have inspired the next generation, especially International Women of Courage nominee Ada Erdem. We loved rooting for Turkey in the Euros and supporting the camaraderie, the friendship, and teamwork that sports inspires between countries. Now, through hard work and old-fashioned diplomacy, we've strengthened our bilateral partnership, promoting security and mutual respect. Our highest level policy dialogue, the strategic mechanism, addressed critical issues, bringing about meaningful progress on matters such as F-16 sales, and Finland and Sweden's accession to NATO. Our joint support for Ukraine has been pivotal, and we are grateful for the role Turkey played in the Black Sea Grain Initiative that ensured global food security. Thanks to Turkey and other allies, we recently brought home individuals who were unjustly detained in Russia. Now together, we've strengthened the NATO alliance, welcoming new members, Finland and Sweden, and we've carried out joint exercise drills and ship visits with American and Turkish troops working together. We celebrated the 75th anniversary of NATO and the NATO summit will take place right here in Turkey in 2026. The United States and Turkey have stood in solidarity, providing essential aid and advocating for peace. I'll never forget the devastating earthquake that shook this nation on February 6, 2023. After the earthquake, our immediate response and continued support highlighted the strength of our partnership and our commitment to our ally, Turkey. Together, we rescued victims, supplied aid, cooked meals for the survivors, and helped rebuild lives and communities. On a personal note, you have made my wife Cheryl, our entire family, and me feel so welcome here. I'll miss the food, the incredible seaside towns, and swimming in the Mediterranean and the Aegean and across the Bosphorus, the rich history, culture, the UNESCO sites, and of course, most of all, I'll miss the people of this amazing country. It feels like leaving our home behind. And for that, I can't thank you enough. It's been an honor to serve in Turkey, and I leave with a heart full of gratitude and memories that I will carry with me wherever I go. Hoşçakalın.